Hi YouTube, Kevy Crew here. Thought I'd show you my latest project. Um, this is our little hallway and as per normal the lighting sucks but um, my wife had wanted a little storage can, um, vessel of some sort storing hats and mitts and scarves and all that sort of stuff because it never gets warm here. And she wanted something that looked antique. We had this which right now is kind of a mess because we're getting ready to give it to our son and right now it's just catching junk. And uh, we had bought it at a department store many years ago and getting a little bit beat up so we decided to look for something else and we looked at various new things and nothing seemed to uh, suit her fancy. Well the other day I was at the recycling bins and somebody had dropped a whole bunch of old furniture off, most of which was pretty junky. But this dresser, it's a three door dresser, it's made out of pine and the, the poles are uh, cast iron and brass. It was painted with a disgustingly ugly coat of, um, I'm calling it a wall paint of some sort. Anyway, it was white, ugly white. Anyway, I, I looked at it, tried out the drawers, and I realized, geez, this is in really good shape. You know, I'm, I'm guessing it's at least 100 years old. I put it in the back of our vehicle, brought it home, and uh, my wife agonized endlessly about what color to choose and finally came up with a type of paint called Brick Red. It's sort of... Uh, brown with some hints of red in there I guess and uh, so I took all the hardware off I cleaned it up really good and gave it a couple of coats of brick red and it was a, it's a self priming paint I'd never used it before it took really well and I took some fine steel wool and uh, scraped all the paint off the hardware put, after the paint was dry I put it all back together et voila I was really amazed the uh, the old-fashioned wooden casters are still functional on the bottom. All the drawers pull smoothly and all the hardware was still in place. I'm guessing that originally there's a little gap in the back there where you can see uh, the backing on it and I'm guessing at one time there might have been a mirror or maybe a little decorative piece that rose up out of the back. But anyway, other than that, it's in great shape, very functional and uh, it goes with the decor my, my wife likes so much. So it was a win-win and the whole project didn't cost much more than 10 bucks. Can't beat that. Woohoo!